A silent crisis is brewing among banks and Freedom Mortgage resolves neglectful FHA lending claims. Ahead on Monday's News Wrap. <music> Trouble is quietly brewing among the largest U.S. banks. Recent earnings statements have shown a dip in profits due to loan losses, increased reserves in the oil and gas sectors, and declines in investment banking revenue and profits. The tough week for banks continued Friday as Citigroup reported a year-over-year -year decline in net profits of 27% during the first quarter in the bank's Q1 earnings statement released Friday, from $4.8 billion down to $3.5 billion. The sharp decline in profits for Citigroup in Q1 echoed a theme that has been reverberating throughout the week for the nation's larger banks. J.P. Morgan Chase, Bank of America, Wells Fargo, and PNC Financial all reported that their net incomes had dropped over the year during the first quarter. Freedom Mortgage Corp. is the latest company to resolve claims that it violated the False Claims Act by knowingly originating and underwriting single-family mortgage loans insured by the FHA that did not meet the mortgage insurer's requirements. The U.S. Justice Department announced that Freedom Mortgage will pay $113 million to resolve allegations that it violated the False Claims Act from 2006 to 2011. You can check out these stories and all the latest happenings in the industry right here on our site. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you again Tuesday at TheMReport.com, your source for the latest news and strategies in the evolving mortgage market.